Okay, good morning. Welcome back to Dina 6 TV pre-production summer series. I have no idea what I'm doing. I love Lucy, question mark. I wanted to come and check out a possible location today so I don't feel overwhelmed. I, you know, I've taken on a big venture and I'm taking one step at a time. So I would let you, I told you I would let you know we're doing this on YouTube. So there's going to be lots of mistakes and I'm repeat Pete. So I tend to repeat myself too. But we're heading in. I'm going to switch this around because we're heading into Mount St. Mary's University. As you all know, because I've told you a thousand times, Dina 6 TV started out as a thesis project which of course I will continue afterwards but it was birthed from uh, having to come up with an idea for my thesis for my master's program so I've, I've already told you ten times I have Dina 6 TV let's let's talk and I've also started this uh, um, live stream interview show which I love I love live stream I love the forum I love the fact that you know you you can't edit I mean I you know edit every week I edit my shows I spend a lot of time in the editing room but with the live stream you can't edit it is what it is so it's funny it's comical to me so let me let me flip this around I think it works yay it didn't shut off so I've showed you this before the Mount St. Mary's university campus and the theater is a little way down so what i'm going to do today is i'm going to check out the theater and i'm going to stop off at the office to get the proper paperwork and to find out when the theater is available there's another theater there's another theater up at the other campus up in the top it's across from the museum it's a beautiful location but i just feel that this is more convenient for people to get to and I was thinking you know I'll run it the first or the second week of the fall semester so the students can come and I have a little audience because you know chewing on this idea I'm gonna make it a TV show because my thesis is film and TV so we're gonna I'm gonna actually make it as if it's a show that's running that it's on the air at the time so we'll have a lot of people running around backstage and also uh, off this off the stage that are actually in the play so I don't know if that makes any sense I'm trying I'm gonna flip this around again and then you know just haha -ha, FYI this is where they shot Veep for many years the Doheny mansion which I probably told you ten times too but it's a gorgeous mansion and you know we get to use a lot of location a lot of the locations at the school but not this one <laughs> they make a lot of money from this from this mansion and it helps support uh, the school Mount St. Mary's school it was started by nuns in like early 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 1900s uh, not in Florida but in somewhere by Delaware I don't even know the history properly isn't that terrible but there's still a few couple of retired nuns they're very old now they have a house in the back in the back of this mansion look at the dimensions of this mansion and that's the Stinson house where we shot the the cup um, and then this is the student lounge here but this is the theater here and I just you know you can sit outside you know I could have a little before party you know a little premiere party Lord knows where I'm gonna get the funds but uh, what does that say you, you you build it and they'll come so everybody's telling me don't worry um, everything will work out in that area but here's the beautiful grounds for the theater it even has comfy chairs over there and you know it's probably gonna be locked but uh, this is the the Rose Hills Auditorium and it's just an old school stage but it works perfectly for the play slash TV show it's probably locked 
All right, let me see. Yeah, I can't get in here now. I'll have to go and talk to the maintenance about getting in. But that's okay, I'm here. And I'm, oh, oh, I thought that was open. And I'm, uh, you know, taking the steps. And that's really what, uh, that's really what pre-production is all about, is just getting organized and taking the first step. For me, and so I don't lose my mind with the project that I took on, is to at least look at the location, secure the location, and then the script is next. So in the next month, six weeks, I'm going to do a nice little first draft. And then once I have the story out of my head and onto the paper, you know, I'm going to have some funny people help me with it. It's not just me. And uh, I'm not sure about the guy-girl thing anymore. I'm not sure. Um, but I do know I'm going to take a couple episodes from I Love Lucy, put them together, and make one funny hell of a play. And then I'm also going to have a funny behind-the-scenes story and backstage story going on. Not necessarily backstage. It would be, you know, in the, in the TV studio backstage while the play is going on. So I'll have a couple different funny scenarios going on. I think I'm going to do it modern day, bringing back I Love Lucy. In, of course, Lucy's, Lucy's uh, I Love Lucy's era. And I think mixing up the, the current and the, and the past will be, you know, super, super funny. But uh, you'll let me know, right? So, okay, so I'm not sure exactly. Let me flip this around. Yeah, so there's the theater. It's just super lovely, and there's parking in the back. That's the, uh, the library for the school. So I won't bother you with that. I just wanted to let you know. I just wanted to let you know that, you know, I am going forward. I promised I would keep you in touch, keep you informed with what's going on. And, uh... I'll see you soon, gang. Consider uh, being be, uh, consider becoming a patron on Patreon. P A T R E O N. You can find that on Google. You know, you could you could donate a dollar a month. It adds up. If I get a hundred people that that donate a dollar a month, you know, I've got another you know another nice little chunk for something that I can buy. Thanks, gang. Dina Six TV Summer Series. Bye.